Fabulous. Now, a leading Wolverhampton artist who spent 50 years working in the city is being remembered through a new exhibition. John Hampton, who was also a local teacher, used his garden in the black country as his inspiration. Our arts reporter Satnam Rama has more. An exuberant expression of colour, light and texture on canvas. This collection of John Hampton's paintings at Wolverhampton Art Gallery is a tribute to the artist, who was also head of art at Bilston Community College. John passed away in February 2012. I walked in here and um, to see it all set up. And someone said to me, you know, what, why have you done this? And I said, um, well, it's just fantastic that he's been acknowledged. You know, his, his contribution in Wolverhampton and in the artistic community has been acknowledged uh, by the gallery and uh, people are going to have the opportunity to come and see the paintings. Hope and optimism were a key aspect of John Hampton's artistic vision and he used the garden as a vehicle to fuel his imagination as well as those who consume his artwork. Although many of the compositions here were painted in his garden studio, John was also a central figure of the city's Eagle Works artist group. He's left a big hole in our group. We accept that his artwork is still here. So there is a, a very large piece of John still, still around us and, and still influencing my work because I've been already been twice to his show and, um, and thought about how he assembled his, his subtle textures, his subtle co colour textures, and how I might perhaps exploit that myself, you know, that idea myself. 26 works are now being shared with everyone until the 13th of July, in memory of the man who dedicated his artistic talents to his home city. Satnam Rana, BBC Midlands Today, Wolverhampton.